isn't going to win, and that is a disappointment to her. She'll now turn her attention to the top of the hill. Vavara Zelenskaya, what can she do? Is three in a row possible? Well, she wasn't on the best of form early in the season, but if she continues like this and comes out next year with the same form, we may well see her as a runaway victory victory in the uh, downhill events well her first win ever was in Narvik last year and she's certainly come a long way since then and uh, winning yesterday will certainly give her confidence for this race but what will it do for her confidence in the Olympics the Russians yet to win a gold medal in the Olympic Games in the Alpine event and that really would be a good move for her Maybe she's been inspired by the performances of Elena Velber in the Nordic World Championships in Trondheim last week. Velber winning five out of five gold medals. And Zelenskaya perhaps just wanting a little bit of the attention herself. Well, she's made it two, and now in her bid to make it three World Cup downhill races in a row, very convincing victory yesterday at the time of 1.35.59. Hildegard currently leading 1.36.67, that's what she's after. And if she can do the same as yesterday, she'll be well inside it. Looks good as she comes off the last hill, and look at that, a whole second ahead for Zelenskaya. That is quite phenomenal. One second ahead of Hildegard, she is now the woman to beat. The others look on in total disbelief. Unbelievable. So, Zelenskaya looking strong for her third consecutive victory as Renata Gerchel starts her descent of the Olympic piste. Oh, Gerchel just losing the edge, recovers well. Need to be immensely strong to recover from that, but a little bit of time lost, no doubt. So, Gertschel disappointed with seventh on the first run here in Hakuba. And uh, she's still very much in the hunt for the downhill title. A win here and a win in Vale would almost sew it up for her and put her well ahead of Heidi Zubrigan. But it needs to be a win. Second place just isn't good enough. Well, she's had uh, a few problems during the season. Ill in the mid-stages of the season, having been very good in Vale where she won. And the seventh is... Uh, Certainly not a best performance. She needs to pick up on it. She knows where she made the mistakes yesterday. So, Renata Gerchel. Hilda Gerg's time of 136.67 is certainly reachable. I can't see her beating that time of Zelenskaya, 135.64. Second place would be anything under 136.67. One thirty-six, one one. She's well inside Gerg's time, but still over four tenths of a second behind the likes of Zelenskaya.